y'all. This is Mandy in the making, and if you want to learn how to make this adorable letter board, keep watching. So here's a list of supplies you'll need, but don't worry, I'll show you as we go along. These are what I'm calling the Scrabble letter trays. I don't know what they're really called, but they come with the game. We're going to take the back of it and hot glue it to the board, so you don't have to worry about painting that part, but we will be painting the rest of it. I'm just using white acrylic paint. You can use whatever you have on hand, whatever color you want, and I mean, if you wanted to leave it just the natural wood color, you totally can. This is up to you. The thing I love about this craft is it's really up to you how you wanna change it up. You can use these um, tile holders or you can just glue the letters directly onto a board if you don't want them to be interchangeable. My thoughts with using the tile holder is like it's, it's similar to the felt boards that are really popular right now. Um, I have one and you'll see it at the end of this video, but this is just a different style, a different type, and it makes it a little more farmhouse feel. You may not be able to put as many words on the board, but it's still a cute idea. And there are four of these um, tile holders that come with it, so you could use all four if your board is big enough. This is the board I'm going to use. I purchased it at Michael's. It was listed for $5.99, but I had a 60% off one item coupon for that day, so I think it was like $2.40. I picked it out because it was already weathered, it already had that farmhouse feel, which is what I was going for, so it was one less step that I had to worry with. I didn't have to paint anything, um, but here I'm just hot gluing these on however I want them. I'm kind of doing them staggered. Like I said, if you have a bigger board, you could definitely use all four, or if you just wanted to use two, you could, but I'm just hot gluing those on and letting them sit for just a minute. Y'all, this DIY took me like 10 minutes. That's my kind of project. I feel like this would be a really unique Mother's Day gift or a gift for anyone for any occasion, or you could just make it for your house. Comment below and let me know if you already have a letter board or if you'll be making this one. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell before you leave so you don't miss any of my future videos. Thanks y'all.